the Indian embassy located in Israel has now emailed the next lot of registered Indian citizens for two special flights. As a part of Operation Ajay, messages to other registered citizens are expected to follow shortly after this. Uh, this message was in fact issued by the Indian Embassy in Israel uh, after two flights, one carrying 212 passengers and the second carrying 235 passengers have successfully landed in India. Joining me on the broadcast to discuss more is my colleague Brian Thomas. Brian, over to you. Uh, we're getting to know that the Indian Embassy in Israel has emailed individuals uh, for two more flights that are scheduled to bring back our citizens. Today as well in the morning at around 6.40, uh, 2.35 uh, passengers were you know, deployed from uh, Tel Aviv to, to India. A very swift and a very in important uh, step taken by by the uh, by the embassy, and now we are getting to know that the embassy has taken a very swift action. You know, by dispatching emails to the next group of registered Indian citizens, felicitating their evacuation through two specially arranged flights today. Earlier, also 212 uh, passengers yes, uh, yesterday, and today 235 passengers were deployed. And this proactive approach also, you know, aims to ensure the safe return of Indian nationals from the affected area. Further communication is expected to be sent out to other registered um, individuals for upcoming flights, indicating the embassy's commitment to, you know, re re repatriate uh, its citizens in a systematic manner. And under the initiative um, Operation Ajay, the efforts to bring Indian citizens home continue un un unabated and in a significant development also. The second phase of this operation saw the arrival of 235 Indian citizens uh, today, today from AI-140 originating from Tel Aviv. The Minister of State, um, uh, State uh, Ranjan Rajkumar Singh also you know, played a very pivotal role in welcoming and felicitating the smooth entry of these citizens at the airport and yesterday Rajiv Chandra Shikhar was also there to welcome and felicitate the, the, the citizens and this gesture you know, end up underscores the government's dedication to ensuring the safe return of its national uh, nationals, providing them with essential support during these challenging times, and these efforts are also a stand um, a stand as a testament to the collaborative approach between the diplomatic missions and the government officials working diligently to safeguard the welfare of the citizens abroad. Even um, Tel Aviv, New Delhi, also you know established 24/7 helpline numbers to you know uh, help help the passengers, uh, help the people who are you know stranded in Israel, the Indian stranded in Israel and the systematic ex execution of evacuation plans also had witnessed today itself in the arrival of the 235 citizens in New Delhi highlights the significance of structured and efficient operations in times of crisis and the government's ongoing commitment to you know, reiterate uh, its citizen demonstrates a very strong sense of responsibility ensuring that no Indian national is left stranded in uncertain circumstances. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.